Let's talk about the primary flight controls. The different parts of the aircraft are known as the wings, the tail section, the nose section, and the landing gear. The tail section is often referred to as the empennage, and from the tail forward, that's known as the fuselage. When we look at the wings from the side, we can see that the edge of the wing that faces forward is called the leading edge, while the back edge of the wing is called the trailing edge. The aircraft can rotate about three different axes. The longitudinal axis, the vertical axis, the lateral axis, we can roll the aircraft about the longitudinal axis using a side-to-side -side rolling motion of the yoke to control the ailerons. The longitudinal axis runs from nose to tail. The ailerons are located on the outward portion of the trailing edge of the wing. When we roll the control yoke to the right, the right aileron raises, the left aileron lowers, and the aircraft rolls to the right. The opposite happens when you roll the yoke to the left. We can pitch the aircraft about the lateral axis that runs from wingtip to wingtip using a forward pushing or pulling towards you motion of the yoke, which controls the elevator. When you push the yoke forward, the elevator moves downward, so the nose of the aircraft moves down. When you pull the yoke towards your chest, the elevator moves upward, so the nose of the aircraft moves up. The elevator is located on the trailing edge of the stabilizer at the tail of the airplane. We can yaw the aircraft about the vertical axis using the rudder. The vertical axis runs from top to bottom through the center of gravity of the airplane. The rudder is controlled by pressing the rudder pedals and is located on the trailing portion of the vertical stabilizer. When you apply pressure to the right rudder pedal, the rudder deflects towards the right, causing the nose of the aircraft to yaw to the right. So to recap, the primary flight controls are the ailerons, the elevator, and the rudder. Ailerons control roll about the longitudinal axis by rolling the yoke to one side or another. The elevator controls pitch about the lateral axis by pushing the yoke forward or pulling it back towards your chest. And the rudder controls yaw about the vertical axis by applying pressure to the rudder pedals. This makes the rudder deflect to the side and causes the airplane to yaw.